women are dating boys. We were, I'm, I'm talking to myself here too, guys. I'm talking to myself when I say this. I was raised, like I said, uh, all of us were raised, we're playing with our, with, our, with our toys, PlayStation, and we're still doing it now. The difference is we're not having fun anymore. We used to have fun. Women are dating boys. We've lost the spirit of men. Imagine, I, I, I see it visually like this. We have a center of gravity here as men. A center of gravity. And there's an energy that flows out into the world from us. You think you don't have an impact? You think I'm just gonna go to this party, I'll just sit in the back and... You always have an impact on every room you enter. Always. You always have an impact. So you get to choose. You should choose you know, what kind of impact you wanna have. You have an energy field that flows into the world. And imagine this. From your center of gravity, you have an energy that flows up and out to the world. An upward, outward flowing energy like this. This is you being charming, being funny, being the life of the party, respectful, opening the door. Uh, um, all of these things like uh, respect and charm and empathy and listening and curiosity, all these wonderful things, storytelling, telling jokes, is all a wonderful upward flowing energy. That's how I imagine it anyway. Imagine if you're, on a, for instance, on a job interview, you're sitting up straight, and everything about you is high energy. You're looking at the guy across from you, and even your eye contact, if, if, if it makes sense, is high. It's a high energy. Yes, yes, okay, yeah, and I did this. It's a high energy, you know what I mean? Okay? Here's the thing. From the same center of gravity, men have an energy that flows down and out. Down and out. An equal force, and equally necessary. This is your mystique, your masculine edge, your sexual, your sexual nature, your, your, your strength, your danger, your fierceness. And this is what we're missing. 